welcome back it's time for another vlog again after a long time many things to show many new things random parts new car one sold I'm gonna talk about that a little bit later in the video because now I'm in the process in changing my rear brake calipers on a new car which you're gonna see in a second and I got everything ready lined up and I just need to start so about the new car Ta -da! it's a Civic EG6 speed up has some dents and scratches is painted red matte which looks kind of ugly to be honest but the price was right and I thought why the hell not because I sold one car as you maybe can see here's my Lexus S13 and one is missing I'm gonna talk about this car later on in the video because now I'm gonna start up with the brake caliper change so I got everything because the rear ones are seized one side the other side is kind of fine so I went out bought some new calipers for the rear whole new set because it was kind of cheap and new hardware and stuff ready to go so wish me luck Calipers are done, installed, uh, they look kind of weird, I already bought some color to paint all the calipers around. Uh, now I need to adjust the parking brake or the e-brake whatever uh, to get it hooked up again because now it is too short. Obviously because the previous brakes were trashed anyway and just readjusted. So that's about that. And after that I gotta bleed the system in the rear, check for the fluid and hope that everything works as it should. Thankfully I got a little device to bleed it myself so I don't need anybody to come and help me out because there's nobody around at this time right now. Hope for the best. I hope the camera runs. So welcome back, time for another vlog. It's time again, uh, I was sick, I was chilling, I have a new job so I got my focus on other things. But now it's time to talk about the new car, the Civic EJ6, which is right there and see what's up with that. And after that I'm gonna finish off the S13 as far as I can because I finally got a place to get it spray painted or painted whatever and I need to make some progress so this can all happen in the next I don't know month or two so the car will be ready for this season hoping for that yes let's see what's up with the Honda so here you can see my EG6 hatch it's spray painted red matte with a black roof, also matte sadly. Stickers I just put on. It's from Uninterested, friend in Germany. I got my UK sticker. I hope you can see it because the camera screen is dark. 
The car itself has a few dings and dents, sadly, because the previous owner used it as a daily, so it wasn't very looked after, but that's okay. We got one here. We got a few scratches here. And on the front, I think there's also something. Yes. Right there. The car itself is lots of fun. I gotta tell you that the B16 is a great engine so far. I did an oil change, did the regular maintenance because it was very needed. So, yes, the front brakes are still clean, mint. The rear ones I've changed. First, I thought it was just the uh, discs and pads, but sadly, the whole pit the whole calipers were stuck so I just got a new set for the rear left and right it's a Honda so the parts aren't that expensive other than that on the outside except the stickers it's just as I bought it not very beautiful but lots of fun lots of fun it has a kw v1 i think suspension i'm not a huge fan of that because it drives like shit but maybe we'll change it up for something better i hope but we'll see and also i got a few friends which i'm talking to to get the rust done it has a few little spots nothing major easy fixes and to get it maybe painted in a cool color and a clean color so the car looks like a car again and not like a beat up 16 year old driven American Civic crap box but first off I gotta finish the S13 before I can make some progress on this one yes interior is stock I just had it cleaned I got some trash from myself in the car fuck it just ignore it I just had the interior cleaned fully. I got a snap off in this car. I, have a, I don't know. I got this of a forum from Germany. No, from Sweden. It does the job. I painted the trim black again because it was red before and it was ugly, sadly. And also these ones the door, hinge, covers, whatever. Uh, I don't know what the previous owner thought. I mean, I think it was painted red in like 213. Ugly as fuck. But now it's black again. I'm still looking for stock ones because you can see that it was painted. Still better than red, but maybe I'll find a set of original ones so I can keep it OEM. I got a cool radio unit. With a tilty boy. Hold up. Just like fast and furious or some shit. <laughs> yes. And I got a subwoofer. I'm gonna take that one out and just replace the speakers in the front. Because I'm not a huge fan of that bass it produces in the rear. Yeah. So that's about that stock shifter. And some bright. Uh, whatever. So let's see the engine bay. Real quick. Opa. B16, great engine. Lots of fun, lots of fun. Cool noises. The VTEC rips you apart. And lots of AliExpress parts. Mm, like this one. Or I don't know, is it AliExpress, but it looks like that. It also had a rear tow hook which I removed because the material disintegrated and it looked like shit and the tow hook looks like complete garbage on the rear of the Civic. We got some password JDM washers and bolts. I think these are not... I mean these are from AliExpress or something. And we got the Neochrome cover which looks like shit 
Hello. Uh, yeah, we got AC. That's cool, and it works. It blows ice cold, and we got these hood dampeners, which I'm gonna remove because I like it OEM with the sticky boy. But that's a problem for later. Yes. Great. And one thing I love about the Civic, the EG6, is the trunk. Because first off you can open the screen, the window, up, and then you can put down the rear hatch like a pickup. I love this. And it's handy. So, that's about the dirty Civic. And now let's continue with the S13. Ta-da! It's time for this again. Make it great. I need to mount the fenders today. I got some over fenders. 40 mils wider, I think. I'm not sure. Yeah. And let's see what happens. I hope I can finish up the body kit fully. Or as much as I can. And maybe start off with the wheels because they need some refresh and other small bits and stuff I gotta do. Oh yeah, let's talk about spacers. The how to improve or check the fitment before buying some spacers edition or prototype one. It does a job to just see how much or yeah how much I need because before the wheels scraps right here and that's no bueno. But easy fix, I just need to order some spacers and the job is done. 